Star <laughs> Stargate says, do you think Apple makes it harder on purpose to do repairs? Absolutely, 100%. They, they, they were more notorious for it in the earlier models. As iPhones progressed, it got progressively easier to fix them. Um, and that is in line with this thing called the Right to Repair Act. The Right to Repair Act was a movement <coughs> pushed from technicians like myself and others, <coughs> other leaders in this industry, where um, it was actually based on John Deere, uh, if anything. But uh, real quick, um, you know, basically farmers were like, hey, uh, John Deere is, not, is, is making it really difficult for us to repair our own stuff so they can overcharge us for them repairing our stuff. Um, and you know, farmers are like, we should be able to repair our own equipment. So then the phone industry is like, yeah, that should be a thing. Companies should make it um, so that it's not so difficult for other people to repair their own stuff, right? So um, that's where the Right to Repair Act came from. And then Apple started caving little, little, little by little. Now the newer phones are much easier to repair than others. And you have access to original repair parts. Because before you had to be some sort of Apple, like you know, authorized dealer to get them. Now, you do not. So, history or school is out of session on that aspect. <laughs> Back to the phone repair.